Welcome to Baseball News Club. My name is Chris. Thank you very much for watching. Today we'll be highlighting Mike Trout's 2019 MVP season. And let's be honest, the guy is a constant highlight. Now, unless you've been living underneath the rock, Mike Trout is one of the best players on the planet, if not top five year after year. And look at this grand slam real quick. Look at the guy on the left. He had it. He just had a scooter a little bit more and he had a baseball. Missed the souvenir and it went to the guy, what, six rows back? Now, from aside from all of Mike's accolades and ridiculous stats, I mean, we got Rookie of the Years, multiple MVPs, All-Stars. Um, he is constantly putting up crazy stats, but aside from that, he's a fan favorite. He's a very humble guy. You consider, you know, you're the best player in the planet or one of the best, and he's not a cocky player. And in fact, he's very well respected through all the league, players, coaches, uh, owners in the league. And look at this play. Base knock to center field, throws out Muncie at home plate, and this was a bang bang play. Blues like, you're gone. Look at this, release the cannon, and this is really super close play. Uh, catcher was able to get the glove just on top of the knee before he got to home plate. Let's take a look at a quick highlight from the All Star game. He's facing Jacob DeGrom, which is one of the best, if not the best, pitchers in Major League Baseball. And during the 18 All Star game, takes some yard. Nice shot. Puts the American League up to nothing, but um, one of the things. If you're not familiar with Mike, since his arrival in the league in 2011 at the age of 19, for eight straight years since then, he's been voted the top MVP in the American League every single season. And not just the top, he's never been ranked or voted higher than fourth. He's been first three times, MVP second four times, and one time he was voted fourth. That is flat out ridiculous. Donkulous. That is just seriously mind-boggling how good he is. And one of the few stats that stick out for me with Mike is his on-base percentage. He takes a lot of walks, which is going to equate to a lot of runs. He's always a top run uh, production player. He's led the league in runs four times. He's led the league in on-base percentage four times. He has a career 419 on-base percentage. Now, one of the unique things about Mike is his swing. It's very compact. There's not a lot of movement. He keeps his hands together. Look at that. Just explodes into the ball. And with that compact swing, that helps him stay consistent at the plate. Even when he's, you know, caught off guard and he's swinging an off-speed pitch and it might put him a little off balance, he's still able to move it around the field easily. Now, the only bummer for Mike is Angels just haven't put together a good enough squad to make it to the postseason just one time in his career. But he's got a lot of baseball left, so we'll see what happens. Now, for his wins above replacement he's constantly the top person in the league i think in 2019 he was ranked third so every stat you look at the guy is just solid now how do you pitch to a guy like this well mike is very well known to take the first pitch uh, when he falls behind he's normal just like a lot of other players with one two oh two counts he's got a low average however when he's ahead in the count he's very aggressive and he likes low pitches. If you get the ball low, he's just going to crush it. Just like this Grand Slam here in Toronto. Just took a low pitch and golfed it out of the stadium. Um, here it is again. Nice side angle. And one of my bugaboos is fans that do not catch baseballs. And look at this. Mike could not have put it, the biscuit in the basket any better. Come on, buddy. Get in the game. But aside from all these numbers, I think one of the key things is Mike's approach and his baseball IQ. He's a very smart baseball player. Here's his 45th career high home run last year. Just crushed it off of Anderson. But just a very smart player, very talented, and excited to see him in the years to come. Thank you very much for watching Baseball News Club. Have yourself a great day.